Welcome back to the Headbangers Ball on Jennifer tonight. We've got Philip and Tracy from L.A. Guns. Hi. So nice to see you so guys nice again. Here. How you doing? Good. What's up, homeboy? Good. Um, first of all, I want to tell you, uh, Kelly Nichols, the bass player of LA Guns, was injured in a really bad motorcycle accident. I know this because uh, I was riding with him that day. It happened about four years ago. And um, he recently, I guess, went back into the hospital. Yeah, yeah he had a rod taken out of his leg. Mm -hmm. he when he broke it, he had a puppy rod. Like, uh, uh -huh. He had to pull it so, out. So um, we've got an address to write to Kelly. Because um, when, when he was in the hospital a couple years ago, we sent him like all these like porno magazines, and he always loves that. So if you want to send that kind of stuff or get well cards or marriage proposals or anything, here's the address. It's Kelly Nichols, care of the Hollywood Vampires, which maybe we'll right. talk about that. 6255 Sunset Boulevard, number 917, Hollywood, California, 90028. Now, Kelly is in the hospital, and you guys are playing. What are you doing for bass player right now? Mixed doing it. Mick's playing bass. Like you remember, Mick used to be the bass player uh -huh. in the band before he got Kelly, so he's just filling in. It's Rather than getting someone else in. Yeah, so you guys are back to a four-piece four now. Four-piece right now, yeah. Okay. Is it, so we're doing a lot of stuff off the first album. Okay, well, right now, let's take a look at the uh, video. This is L.A. Guns, the one that's kind of been getting you right up the charts. That's right. Here's if you haven't seen this video, you must be living under a stone. Exactly. Somewhere. This is the Ballad of Jane. Ballad of... The Salad of... Once again, we're back in the Headbangers Ball with Philip and Tracy from L.A. Guns. Oh. Now... You guys are playing some shows with the London Choir Boys, right? Yeah, oh. a tour. Uh huh. Like uh, six weeks. As a matter of fact, uh, it's fun. Uh huh. How's Good the show's guys. been going? Uh, it's great. You know, ever since the Salad of Jane video came uh -huh. out, you know, things have been pretty. Because you're hearing that like on all the top 40 radio stations, Kiss and it's FM. really just yeah, you which is a big that. top 40 station in LA. Um, also, I guess Mick is filling in for somebody in the Choir Boys. Oh, well, uh, just for a couple of shows, um, Chris, the keyboard player, had to go back to England, uh -huh. and uh, they got him up to play some songs. So you're keeping him pretty busy? Well, yeah. It just seems like this whole year's been like every band, like members have been like, you know, going, dropping out for a couple of weeks and stuff. Mm -hmm. Like every band, it's really weird. Mm -hmm. yeah. You never know who's going to play in which band. Yeah. Now, tell us about the uh, new home video you come. Did you remember on the last home video, I played a bartender? That's all right. right. <laughs> for did. about two seconds. Well, That's right. That was a one-way ticket, wasn't it? Mm, I think so. Yeah. Well, tell us about the new one, you guys. Well, okay, so we got uh, Rip and Tear, Never Enough, uh, The Salad of Jane. Uh, malaria? Mala oh, Malaria. We did like a video for Malaria. What's that going to be like? Uh, it's kind of like, um, it, 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 it's, you know, they're, they're not going to release it as a single, so it's going to be... Um, Dirty? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's, it's a gritty kind of uh, a clip, and, and uh, it's lots of... Um, backstage, you know, goofing around with black and white Super 8 stuff, and it's good. It's, it, it really gets the, the character of the band across, okay. and, and, and I Want to Be Your Man, man. And it's which called, we did on the stage. Tell them what let's, it's talk, let's talk a little bit of about I Want to Be Your Man when we come back. Right. But right now, let's take a look at the results of last week's Headbangers Ball Busters. Now, remember, you got the choice to vote between Death Angel, Seemingly Endless Time, and Dio's Wild One. Now, in a few minutes, the winner's going to take on Slaughter's Fly to the Angel. Who was, oh, well, we'll talk about that later. But right now, here's the number five Skull Crusher of the Week. Here's Steve Vai. The audience is listening. Okay, uh, once again, Philip and Tracy from L.A. Guns. Now, we were talking a little bit about the uh, videos, and we are going to see a video for I Want to Be Your Man, which yeah. is the next single. Yeah, we wanted to bring it here today, but I guess it's not quite ready. It's not done. But we will see it as soon as it's ready. Yeah, right, exactly. definitely. And, of course, you can see it in your home by buying the home video, which is called Love, Peace, mm -hmm. and Geese. Okay, now, explain. <laughs> or, or shouldn't well, we see, explain? No, exactly. It, it's not too much to explain. We didn't really want to do anything, like, tough, because it, that would be pretentious, and, and, and we didn't... I don't know, it just sounds good, doesn't well, it? Geese aren't too pretentious. Well, well, the thing is, is, you know, the big sex booze and tattoos, yeah. things that we've uh -huh. always done, everybody's ripping it off mm -hmm. now. So we wanted to come out with something to fill in for sex booze and tattoos that just didn't mean That's anything. That's right. And put a bit of humor in it. So let's see know. if like all the new bands that come out are now going to have all these things oh, with geese on it. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, but we yeah. used the word geese before LA Guns did. Yeah. Now, exactly. um, how much more touring do you guys have to do? Two weeks. Yeah, two, three weeks. And then what are you going to do? Oh, we're not going to say. No. You're not going to tell us what you're going to do, or? Oh well, you know, we got to do another record while this one's still hot, so we can get it out there, so we can keep the momentum going. Have you started writing it for it yet? Yeah, kind of. I think we've all started writing, yeah. but not collectively. Yet. Is that when you guys do write music for the new record? Does everybody kind of go off on their own? Every song come up with ideas? Every song's different. It comes together in a different way. You know, sometimes we can sit in a studio with nothing, and then we can create a song. Mm -hmm. Other times, either one of us or any of the band can come in with a completely finished. Um, There's always idea. too many songs. So it's really collaborating. Yeah, yeah. yeah. 
Yeah. Great. Well, I want to thank you guys for coming in. It was thank good you. to see you again. Yeah, and nice congratulations on the success. It's doing nice. good, huh? Anyway, right now, um, it's time to vote for tonight's Headbangers Ball Buster video. Tonight, our champ takes on Slaughter, Flight to the Angels. Now, the number to call if you want to vote is 1-900-370-0100. Each call costs 50 cents. We'll play both videos back-to-back, -back, starting with last week's winner, and here it is.